we're gonna be getting the Middle Path Spike Factory, Carboto Spikes, and we're going to be unlocking not the T6, not the T7, not the T8, not the T9, not the T10, but the T11 Floor of Spikes upgrade. All right, everybody. So if you guys are excited, you know what to do. Hit that like button. Let's jump into today's video. We'll just put our little Spike Factory down right there for now. Get a faster production. It'll be interesting to see if I'll be able to actually survive with just one Spike Factory. I, I don't know if it's gonna be possible. I think it is. I wonder if bigger stacks is better than even faster production. They cost the exact same amount of money, right? I'm gonna get bigger stacks for now. The way this works, if you haven't seen any of our uh, fully upgraded T6 Ultra Towers mod series, which if you haven't, please, there's a playlist where we've done We've done so many. We've done like 20 or 30 of these, maybe even more. And so the first thing we have to do is we have to unlock it to the T5 tower, which is normally the max that you can get. Once we get it to the T5, we have to get 100,000 pops on it, and then it'll automatically upgrade into the T6 tower. From there, we have to start buying the next upgrades for the tower, where it does get rather expensive rather quickly. So we need to be ready for that. I'm gonna, I don't actually need anything, and it looks like this guy is kind of, kind of destroying it on his own right now. So, while they're doing that, I think I'm just gonna go ahead and grab a banana farm, because we are gonna need a decent amount of money. We need to get the middle path spike factory, and we're gonna probably want some other things as well, like an alchemist, a village to kind of give it an attack speed boost, because we want this tower to be getting all of the pops, right? Because we want it to upgrade as quickly as possible. Guys, by the way, I found, I found the coolest thing the other day I was reading online, okay? Did you guys know that it is impossible to breathe through your nose and smile at the same time? Ha! <laughs> I made you smile, didn't I? <laughs> and then I can get larger potions, acidic mixture dip, and then that'll increase attack speed, and he gets the acidic mixture dip on that. I think I want to save up and get the ability. So I'm gonna go ahead, we can get Moab Shredder, and then Spike Storm. Spike Storm is just so nice to have. Once I get Spike Storm, I'm like, okay, I, I can't really lose unless I'm bad. Nothing really too crazy to worry about. And I'm just gonna buy it now, just so I don't lose. Just so we don't have some awkward moment where we just lose and it's like, oopsies. Today is the day we become overpowered. Finally, I'll have some friends. I get to show them how cool my Spike Factory. Hey guys, you wanna watch me play balloons? Come on guys, you wanna subscribe to my balloons channel? I guys, I want you to know, okay? I unironically promote myself when I play games. For example, I like to play Valorant. I'll just randomly type in chat, be like, hey guys, anyone here like Balloons Tower Defense? And people are like, oh, I love that game. Played it all the time as a kid. And I go, oh great, subscribe to my balloons channel. And people are always like, oh yeah, sure. I'll go subscribe to your balloons channel thinking it's like I have like a hundred subs or something. And then they're like, oh man. That's you? You you have that? And I was like, yeah, man, that's me. Oh, that's a- Ah! See, like, you just use that ability, and you're good. I do want to go ahead and try to get Carpet of Spikes. Regularly sets a Carpet of Spikes over the whole track, which is just so nice. But it is $43,000. Am I going to be okay here? I might- Oh, I barely was able to manage that. Oh, ceramic balloons. Ugh. Am I going to be okay? Yeah. I'm going to lose a couple magic lives, but I'd rather have my ability on lock and ready especially when all these balloons are about to come through. Oh my gosh, I need to get this T5 soon. I'm gonna lose. I have to sell this. I, I have to sell and get the carpet of spikes. There we go. I had to sell it or else I think I would have lost. Floor of spikes, there it is. It's 28% of the way ready to go, everybody. Look how fast this thing already attacks. This thing attacks crazy fast. This thing does a lot of damage. And one of the things that I kind of didn't think about is I always assume that the main focus of this is the ability itself, and that's not necessarily the case. It puts out a lot of spikes. This is probably an underutilized T5 upgrade, I'd say. We're at 60% of the way. I think we can go ahead and just skip some rounds. This tower is really solid. Like, I haven't even needed to use the ability, and it just, look at this, it shreds Moabs. Oh, there we go, it just upgraded, yo! That is gnarly looking. Oh my goodness. So it does five damage right now. It spews out really fast, actually. This upgrade is going to add five damage. It's going to reduce the attack speed by 33% or increase the attack speed. So there we go. We got the first upgrade for it. So this is the T7 now because it upgraded once into a T6. We bought the upgrade. So now it's a T7 upgrade. So now look at how fast the spikes are coming out. 
That is insane. Let's jump up to like round 95. Does he have what it takes as a T7 tower to deal with 95? If we need to, I have the ability unlocked too, but I don't, nothing's even getting up here. Oh my gosh. Oh, is it going to be enough? That's such a crazy crazy tower we won we still have a lot to go i we still have so many upgrades to get for it and it's just absolutely destroying the balloons so we're upgrading into a t8 so it's doubling the damage actually its damage was it went from 10 damage to 30 damage and it is destroying things that was round 100 so it's just 30 damage per spike i mean look at the ddts like just one of the spikes is destroying it right now What's the next upgrade cost? $95,000. All right, we're getting close to it. I'm actually so hyped for it. All right, $95,000. So this is going to be upgrading into a T9, everybody. Three, two, one. And it also gets the fortified shredding ability. So it looks like it does just extra damage to fortified balloons. I mean, look at this. Nothing's getting even remotely close right now. All right, do we do something crazy here? The next upgrade's $120,000. Let's ramp up the difficulty. Round 120. Nothing's even getting close to getting by right now. I feel like I have to. We jumped to round 200. Let's see how round 200. So here's the fortified BAD on round 200. This thing, I, I feel like is... Oh my gosh! Holy cow! You guys seeing what I'm seeing? I'm not even upgrading this thing. Round 300. I haven't even needed to upgrade it yet. Look at all... Okay, this looks a little bit more... All right, this is starting to be a little bit scarier. All right, I'm going to upgrade it again. Okay, so the next upgrade, it adds 900 damage. It's 10 times damage. I just... Up oh my gosh, look at how many spikes it's spewing out. So it's a T10 right now, and it does a thousand damage, and it is annihilating these balloons now. All right, let's jump up to round 400. You know what? I'm feeling spicy. Let's try round 500. How many pops is that? That's 200 million pops. Oh my gosh. This thing's a menace to society, friends. It's not even on the final upgrade. All right, everyone. It's time for us to get the final upgrade, all right? We've seen what it can do. It has a thousand damage right now. So the next upgrade adds 1,000 damage. And it gives you plus quad spikes. Oh, no, I lost. I wasn't ready. I was reading the description. All right, let's upgrade it. So this is the final upgrade now. So we... Oh, my God. Look at how many spikes come out. It's lagging my game. Actually lagging the game. One billion pops, my friends. Let's jump to, like, round 2,000. Because this game is lagging, and I don't want it to lag forever. Will it be... I don't know what's happened. Is it getting, is it, it's at 3 billion pops now. It's actually, no, no, it wasn't able to beat round 2000. We're trying to hit 1.5 million subscribers and I'd love for you to be a part of it. Thank you so much for watching. Huge shout out to Cosmic for making today's mod. Make sure to subscribe, turn on notifications. It helps me out tremendously. 